Hello, this is Sarita, and I'm here to help you understand the truth about who you are. So I'm really happy and excited to share with you today a very intensive pineal gland activation meditation, which is going to allow you to not only activate your pineal gland, but do it through an expanded perception from within heart resonance. So what we're going to do is once the pineal gland has been activated, we're going to align it with the heart center so that your perspective is coming through a heart centered awareness. And this is a meditation that I created and I did it with my Patreon group about a week ago. And we had some really good results from it. And I've received lots of great feedback from email and messages, people having really quite out their experiences and even having experiences where uh, their bodies or their heads shook as blockages within the pineal gland were released, which then allowed them to perceive beyond non-ordinary reality. And this is what the pineal gland does. It allows you to increase and expand your perception beyond your limitations, beyond the limited visible light spectrum of what you think you know about in this reality. Now, remember that the pineal gland allows you to release DMT. And that's what you're doing. You're releasing DMT into the brain when you activate the pineal gland. And so what that does is you can perceive beyond the dimensional space of this third dimension. You can then see into higher and more expanded dimensions, because what happens is, is that your pineal gland is full of these crystals that are... Um, electromagnetic crystals that have a luminescent quality about them. So when they're activated and invigorated, they, they, they release light basically into your brain. And the pineal gland and the crystals within it are essentially portals, their doorways into other dimensions. And obviously your heart center is also a portal or a doorway into the heart of the cosmos. So it's not that your heart center connects with other portals within the cosmos. It's that your heart center is the same cosmic doorway as the heart center of everyone and everything else within our multiverse, within all of reality as we know it. It's a direct connection to the divine. And so what we're going to be doing in this meditation is we're using our focused intention, which is always the primary creational tool in any meditation but we're also going to be using breath work and the meta womb to activate our pineal gland so we're going to be using two different types of breath work we're going to be using just focused intentional breathing Remembering that the breath is a bridge to the divine and the breath is the way that we call light from the kind of plasmic field into a matter-based, crystallized form within our body. So breath is always a bridge to the divine, bringing 
if you like, ideas and light and information from source cos co uh, from source cos consciousness into being in this manifested reality into our matter based being. But we're also going to be using breath of fire, which many traditions have used over millennia and which shamans particularly use because breath of fire is a belly breath that really activates and ignites energy to kind of burst into being or to burst into flame it works the same way as if you were breathing into a fire oxygenating a fire so that it would burst into flame so the focus breathing is very simple and the belly breath i will ex the breath of fire will explain to you in a moment and then the third component that we're going to use in this meditation is the meta womb and this is a microcosmic aspect of the womb of all creation it's a form of geometry that i am bringing into a lot of meditations because what it does is when you place yourself in this geometric energetic field which is essentially a black sphere that represents the womb of all creation what that does is it allows you to let go of the limitations and the perceptions of yourself within this third dimensional matter based reality and allow you to dissolve yourself into the void which is a pre creational space where anything can be created so it takes you back into pure raw potentiality and what we're going to be doing in this meditation is we're going to release all of the crystals which are actually and physically found within our pineal gland in our brains we're going to release those crystals out into the meta womb space that we've created so that they can then be as the portals that they are able to perceive through those portals or through the windows if you like into source consciousness and see the pure potentiality and see into the other dimensions that are available to us when we open our third eye and the other thing that we're going to do in this meditation is we're going to connect our third eye to our two actual physical eyes so that they become one if you like one eye or one form within us which will allow us to have the practice or the intentionality of seeing simultaneously into ordinary and non-ordinary reality and what this means is that as you go about your day-to-day -day living you're going to be able to see energy and matter simultaneously and this is really really important because this is something that um is normal for me it's just normal for me i see energy and matter simultaneously all of the time and what that does is it allows me to live in a more expanded state of being my um intuition and my instinct and my empathy and my heart resonance are all interwoven in my material life and i know for many of you have who have done a lot of inner work this is becoming normal for you as well which is an absolutely beautiful way of being but also it's essential for our intrinsic evolution into fifth dimensional consciousness which is a unity heart based christ like consciousness where we're able to perceive the effects of how our material physical existence affects people intrinsically on a soul energetic and spiritual way and what that does is it 
it really kind of forces us, force is the wrong word, but it forces us to take stock of the truth that everything that we do affects everyone and everything else. And when you have this expanded perception, when you have this ability to see into an ordinary and non-ordinary reality simultaneously, you see the effect of everything that you think and do and say. And of course, that's going to change us. It's going to help us take full responsibility for who we are, and that's going to evolve us at a faster pace. So that all being said, I'm going to explain the meditation to you. You don't need to have to remember any of this because I'm going to guide you through the whole meditation anyway, but it's good to know what's coming so that you're not using your analytical mind. You can really drop into the sensations that are, that are appearing for you when we do the meditation. So this is how it's going to go. I'm going to make you feel relaxed, and then we're going to place ourselves in a meta womb, which is a black sphere. You're then going to fill this sphere from the bottom up with, upwards with the black, inky, amniotic fluid of the void. You're going to allow yourself to dissolve into this fluid. I'm then going to ask you to bring your awareness to your pineal gland in your brain. It's a tiny gland which looks like an acorn and is about the size of a grain of rice. It's minute. And when I ask you to focus on this gland, don't get caught up worrying analytically if you've got the right place in your brain. Let your intuition and the meditation guide you in. OK, so you're going to focus on the gland. I'm going to get you to kind of feel and see what it looks like. And then what we're going to do is we're going to do breath of fire for one minute into the gland. Pause for a minute. Feel the gland. Breath of fire for a minute. Pause for a minute. Breath of fire for a minute. Pause for a minute. Now, breath of fire is a belly breath. You can put one hand on your belly to feel if your belly is going in and out and one hand on your chest to make sure that you're not chest breathing. So you want the hand on your chest to stay still and the hand on your belly to move in and out. And it's good to have a practice of this before the meditation. So belly breath looks like this, breath of fire. And my belly's moving in and out and it's a breath through the nose. And if you do it properly, you will feel a lot of heat rising. And what you're trying to do is you're trying to imagine that you're actually doing the breath in the pineal gland itself. So although, of course, you're physically doing the breath in your belly, you're going to be imagining that you're, it's your pineal gland that's doing the breathing. So have a practice of that before we begin the meditation. So having done a, the breath of fire in the pineal gland, I'm then going to get you to feel into your two actual eyes. And we're then going to do a focused um, geometric piece where, piece where you're going to imagine a line moving from between your pineal gland to your two eyes. So it's a triangle. It's a triad. And we're going to do this for about three minutes. You're just going to imagine this line like this going Round, 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 until those three are connected and become one, where three become one. This is the Holy Trinity. It's another aspect of the Holy Trinity. And then what we're going to do is we're going to do a focused, elongated breath, very easy, just breathing normally, but focusing on the breath going into that triangle and activating this now one internal eye, okay? What's then going to happen is you're going to bring your awareness back to the pineal gland and you are going to consciously open the pineal gland just like a pine cone opens and you are going to release all the crystals within your pineal gland and they're going to float up and out of your pineal gland and into the void, into the meta womb, 
that we have previously created around us. And they're going to float around and I'm going to give you some time to feel these crystals in the void, just feeling what that feels like. And what you're doing here is you're expanding your perception to have an interdimensional awareness because, of course, those crystals are always communicating with the pineal gland that is now intrinsically connected to your eyes. Okay, so I'm going to get you to feel that for a little bit. We're then going to bring our awareness back to the pineal gland and drop it into the heart center and feel the pineal gland in the heart center so that now your perception is going through the heart center portal, through the pineal gland, connected to the eyes and out into the void. So you're having this expanded heart centered perception. I'm going to allow you to feel that for a little while and then I'm going to bring you back into your heart center. You'll release the pineal gland back to its original space and then you're going to come back into the room and open your eyes. So hopefully by now you can perceive why this is such an intensely powerful meditation. So don't worry about remembering any of that. As I said, I'm going to guide you through the whole thing. And without further ado, let's go ahead and do the meditation. Hopefully you've had a practice, pause this video, had a practice of the fire breath. And when you're ready, I'm going to invite you to sit up straight if you can. And then you're going to take a breath in, take a breath out, let go of everything I've just said and close your eyes. Let go of your day. Let go of your external reality. Let go of thoughts and emotions. Let go of getting any of this right. We're just playing in this reality with our pineal gland. And just let the breath flow in and out very gently and easily. And feel your body relaxing more. Slowing down. And as you relax, feel your body allowing a little more space inside of you so that you're not holding tension or restriction. you're going to set your intention now to activate your pineal gland. And we're going to now place ourselves in a meta womb, the cosmic womb, the voided space where all potential exists. A pre-creational space, a safe space. So creating now a black sphere all around you. Feel it entirely encapsulating your body and your biofield. And you're now 
going to fill this sphere with the black, inky, amniotic fluid of the void. Allowing it to rise up from the bottom of the sphere. Rising higher and higher. And feeling yourself submerging into it. Merging into it. Dissolving into this fluid. This warm and gentle, lulling fluid. Feel yourself dissolving, dissolving into it. Losing your boundaries and your limitations. Becoming weightless, formless. Floating in this inky blackness of the void. Floating and willing and able to activate your pineal from this pre-creational existence. So I invite you now to begin to turn your attention inwards to a place and a space within the darkness in which you find your pineal gland within your brain geometry. As you bring your awareness to this gland, notice its location within you. details of this powerful gland become more and more sharp, clearer and clearer to you. awareness to this gland, the master gland within the matter of your being. And using our breath of fire, our will, and our intention, we are going to activate to light up this gland 
with breath of fire. So when you're ready, beginning to breathe breath of fire into the gland, off you go. Pause and feel the gland. Feel the activation beginning. breath of fire into the gland of the go. And pausing and feel the gland, feel the activation, the light and the heat activating it. breath of fire once again.
and pausing and feel the activation. an awareness upon the pineal gland, your inner eye, you are now going to expand that awareness to include your two external eyes. Notice the distance between them. And you are now going to connect these three eyes with a triangle of light. So beginning at your left eye, you are going to draw a line of light to your right eye. From your right eye to your pineal gland. And now back to your left eye and you're going to keep drawing this triangle of light for three minutes. And feel how these three have become one, a triad, three into one, your inner eye and your external eyes now absolutely intrinsically and geometrically connected. And into this one triangle, your internal vision triangle, you are going to breathe, filling this triangle, this geometry of the one vision with your breath. 
long, slow, focused breath. And bringing your awareness now back into the pineal gland itself. Taking your awareness deeper and deeper into the gland. Until you can feel within its depths and see within its depths, the crystals that make it up. Feel the sacred crystalline structure within. Feel the hundreds and hundreds of crystals packed tightly together. Each holds its own awareness. its own information. And is connected to every other crystal within the gland. Feel them more and more.
and when you're ready, you are going to begin to expand and open this gland. Opening, opening, so that the crystals which are like seeds within the gland are released now and one by one begin to float out of the gland out and out and into the void the meta womb all around you. One by one, they are released. floating, floating out into the voided space. Out and out until every single crystal has been released. And now they float within the void all around you, behind you, to your left, to your right, beneath you and above you, deeper and deeper into the void. Feeling the information and the raw potential of what is held within this space. And allow yourself to feel all of the information that every single crystalline structure is perceiving all at once all of them simultaneously Feel it more and more, deeper and deeper into the void.
feel how you are omnipresent and omnisentient through these crystals. How your awareness is expanded, is heightened, is non-locational. Everywhere, all at once. And keeping this omnipresent, omnisentient awareness within the field of your perception and reality, you are now going to bring the pineal gland within your head down the body, descending it until it arrives within your heart center. And as it arrives there, breathing into the heart center, allowing the breath and your attention to merge the pineal gland with the heart center blueprint. As you feel this merge, keep your awareness of the floating crystals. The crystals in infinite locality and non-locality simultaneously transmit their information into your heart center. And receive information from your heart center. And feel how you can see into the all that is, into pre-creational space with your heart awareness.
and feel yourself as heart expanded, heart consciousness everywhere and all at once. And as you connect into this sensation, gently releasing the pineal gland from the heart center to rise and rise back to its place within the brain. knowing that you are now more expansive through your inner eye that you can see into the depths at more levels of reality into the void of pre-creational space and potential. You are very gently and very slowly going to come back into the room and open your eyes. <laughs>